Cole Palmer, currently thriving at Chelsea, had an unexpected journey, beginning this season under Pep Guardiola's guidance at Manchester City. Despite a strong rapport with Guardiola, Palmer was released. Surprisingly, the English talent, born in 2002, initially declined the chance to join Manchester City's senior squad, even though he had been part of the academy since age eight. The player Tribune reveals Palmer's early struggles with self-esteem due to his stature, but his father's unwavering support propelled him forward. Although small in size, Palmer's tenacity caught the eye of his local club coach, Graham Fowler, who foresaw his potential. The turning point occurred when Palmer captained Manchester City's under-18 team during the 2019-20 season, showcasing his skills with 14 games, 15 goals, and 5 assists. Recognizing Palmer's intelligence, calm demeanor, quick decision-making, and vision, Guardiola viewed him as a promising prospect, akin to Phil Foden. Palmer's close association with Pep Guardiola solidified when he earned a spot in City's senior squad during the 2020-21 season. The breakthrough came when Pep directly enlisted Palmer's talent for the senior team, marking his debut on 30 September 2020 against Burnley in the League Cup. Further proving his mettle, Palmer was entrusted with a Champions League debut against Marseille. Despite these opportunities, Palmer featured in only two matches across all competitions that season. Pep consistently sent him back to Manchester City's elite development squad, competing in Premier League 2. This trend persisted into the 2021-22 season, where Palmer played just 11 games across all competitions. Even after joining City's senior squad, he continued to participate in Premier League 2 with the EDS squad after a Premier League appearance against Burnley in October 2021. Asked about this strategy, Pep emphasised Palmer's need for more playing time to enhance his skills, deeming the EDS team in Premier League 2 as an ideal developmental ground. Pep expressed a reluctance to rush young talents like Palmer into continuous senior squad duties. In the previous season, Pep had already conveyed that playing time was not guaranteed for young players, reiterating the intense competition within the star-studded City squad. In the current season, Palmer unexpectedly found favour in Pep's eyes during pre-season matches. His notable goal in the European Super Cup against Sevilla elevated his status. With the departure of Riyad Mahrez, City's faithful anticipate Pep utilising Palmer more frequently especially on the wing. Pep has consistently commended Palmer's attitude, portraying him as a patient and humble player, according to Manchester City's official website. Despite his improved performance, Palmer understands that being selected as a starter isn't guaranteed. Contrary to this perceived patience, Team Talk reports reveal that Palmer has, in fact, expressed a desire for more playing time, demanding additional minutes from Pep Guardiola. This demand reportedly angered Pep, especially considering Palmer's relatively brief tenure in the Premier League. Pep firmly rejected Cole Palmer's requests, maintaining his stance despite the player's evident quality improvement. Pep, known for taking decisive actions with players like Ibrahimovic and Yaya Toure, stood firm and eventually parted ways with them. Consequently, Pep Guardiola has left Palmer's future in the hands of Manchester City's management. As reported by Eurosport, Pep openly stated his willingness to entertain offers for Cole Palmer. The Daily Star's report suggests that Pep would be content if Palmer sought more playing time at a club other than Manchester City. Interestingly, the emergence of a new wonder kid, Oscar Bob, is suspected to be a contributing factor in Pep's willingness to part ways with Palmer. Furthermore, Oscar Bob stands out as a character known for his lack of demands, aligning with Pep's preference for developing and demanding young talents. Oscar Bob, who has been elevated to City's senior squad this season, has received praise from Pep, being recognised as the best player in Manchester City's academy for two consecutive seasons. While Bob's playing minutes in the senior squad remain limited, he embodies the kind of player Pep desires in terms of attitude and dedication. Palmer's departure, driven by accumulated impatience, led the club to seek a win-win solution. Tsiki Bejaristin enacted a strategic policy, responding to a favourable offer from Chelsea. 
Palmer was subsequently transferred to Chelsea for a substantial sum of £42.5 million. Now a key player in Mauricio Pochettino's squad, Palmer has achieved the playing time and prominence he sought at Chelsea. His performance is on an upward trajectory, and if he maintains consistency, there's a possibility of him emerging as one of the future stars for the Blues. The question remains, will Pep feel disappointed, or did he anticipate that a player like Palmer might not reach star status?